The human eye is a complex machine. Its various parts work together quickly to help us see. The cornea is a transparent dome-shaped tissue covering the front of the eye. It bends and focuses light as it passes through. The pupil is a dark opening in the center of the iris. It is like a window through which light enters the eye. The iris or colored portion of the eye that surrounds the pupil expands and contracts, making the pupil bigger or smaller to let the right amount of light enter the eye. The light rays then pass through the lens which further bend the rays and focus them on the retina, the light sensitive tissue lining at the back of the eye. The retina converts the light rays into impulses which are then sent through the optic nerve into the brain where they are recognized as images. The pupil and the lens keep adjusting themselves so that we see the object clearly. 70% of the eye's focusing power comes from the cornea and 30% from the lens. When we can't see clearly, it is often caused by a refractive error. There are four types of refractive error. Myopia or nearsightedness. This is when the light rays focus in front of the retina instead of on it. This can happen when the eyeball is longer or there is a change in the focusing power of the cornea or lens. With myopia, closer objects will appear clear, but distant objects will appear blurred. Hyperopia or farsightedness. This is when the light rays are focused behind the retina instead of on it. This can happen when the eyeball is shorter or there is a change in the focusing power of the cornea or lens. Distant objects will appear clear, but closer objects will appear blurred. Astigmatism occurs when the cornea is irregularly shaped. Light passing through this uneven cornea is not properly focused on the retina. Distance and close vision may both appear blurry. Presbyopia. This is a normal condition that typically begins after 40 years of age. The lens becomes less flexible and less able to focus on closer objects, making them blurred. These eye conditions can be diagnosed and corrected easily. Still, refractive error remains the main cause of moderate and severe visual impairment among millions of people across the globe.